apply this yoga routine to unwind and de-stress from any circumstance that you need to relax from and release some tension in your body and your mind. So we're gonna start up standing nice and tall, heels right behind your toes, shoulders relax away from your ears. Maybe rock a little forward and back just to find your balance on your two feet there. Take a big inhale, reach your arms all the way out and up over your head, interlace your hands, press your palms right upward. And then as you exhale, we'll gently fold over your legs. Go ahead and interlace your hands behind your back. Take a gentle shoulder opener here. Let the knees bend pretty much here so you can really match your belly and your thighs together. We feel really good. A lot of space opening up in the backs of the legs. Keeping the clasp of the hands, take a big inhale, lengthen out a bit in front of you, look out a bit in front of you. And as you exhale, gently fold a bit forward, inward toward the legs. Breathing here for a few moments. Really let the head go, really let your neck go. One more time, just like that big inhale, keeping the clasp lengthen out a bit in front of you and then as you exhale folding and maybe there's a little more space here that you can just gently slip into breathe a lot gently release your fingertips down to the ground maybe sway a little side to side just to really undo any kinks or tension in the whole back and neck area where we carry a lot of the stress take a big inhale nice wave through the spine looking out in front of you as you exhale around and would relax bend the knees one more time like that big inhale lengthen out of it in front of you big wave through the spine relax inward again just one more time like that lengthen out of it in front of you this time press your palms down we'll step right back to your plank pose nice strong steady plank pose here top of your head reaching forward heels reaching back sometimes when you use a little bit of effort you can start to really unwind all of the extra stuff in the body the tension here go to lift the hips we'll press back to your downward dog relax your heels relax your shoulders gently roll all the way out from a plank pose here leading with the upper back ease your knees down we're going to sink into a nice upper dog maybe sway a little side to side drop the shoulders away from your ears lengthening the chest forward when you're ready tuck the toes we'll lift all the way back to your downward dog again just like that you're really rolling through the spine like a nice big wave rolling into shore out into your plank easing the knees down let the hips sink bend the elbows as much as you need to sink into this nice upper dog you're lifting up when you're ready again tucking the toes lifting your hips up and back to that nice downward dog again just like that rolling out big wave the spine releasing all the tension here in your shoulders drop the knees down sink your hips into that nice upper dog shoulders roll right down the back reaching your chest forward this time keeping your knees on the ground shift your hips up and back sit on your heels you can tuck your toes if you like to round the back the other way nice child's pose here for a few breaths and when you're ready lift the hips will come all the way back into your downward dog relax the heels and shoulders we'll take a nice slow steady stroll up to the top of your mat here just winding things down cooling things out here especially when there's stress and anxiety there may be a little bit of tension a little bit of of a desire to move quickly so just see if you can slow it down a bit i'm going to come into a nice squat here opening up the body a bit rolling out to one side lengthen out your whole spine and same thing up and over to the other side here tucking that right shoulder inside of the leg lengthen out your whole body from the tailbone all the way up the top of your head when you're ready, gently ease your hips down. We'll open the legs out to the side into a nice straddle. Don't make this too intense here. Just come to where you feel a little bit of tension, but not so much that drives you bananas here. So we'll take a twist around your right side. One fingertips in front, one fingertips in your back. And then same thing to the other side, twisting around. And then we'll gently fold up and over that right leg here. See if you can make this just as much of a twist as a forward bend to that left side of your back, really draping around the leg here. Maybe let your head go, maybe let your neck go. Slowly, when you're ready, we'll crawl it through center. Same thing, other side. Just one hand resting on either side of that left leg, wrapping that right side of your back around, breathing a lot. When you're ready, gently bring it all the way back to your middle. If it feels really good to let your forehead just simply rest on your hands, on the top of your hands, it's a really calming, nice thing to do to ease the mind. Breathe a lot into your back. Every inhale here creates more space in your body, space in your mind. Every exhale simply moves you right into that space. When you're ready, gently ease yourself all the way up to a nice comfortable position. You can sit easily, shoulders relax right down your back, coming back to your breath, letting your tension softly rest there. One last thing to release tension in your eyes, go ahead and rub the palms of your hands together pretty quickly to get some heat going. We'll close your eyes, press the heels of your palms right into your eyeballs there. Make sure the eyes are closed, don't push too hard. Breathing a lot. 
And once you've had enough of that, gently relax your hands back down to your thighs. If it feels good to flip your palms open, this may feel nice once you've released some of this tension to become a little bit more open, a little bit more soft. Breathing a lot here. And thank you. I really hope that helped and have a great day. Bye.